Welcome, this is Hope Kaya of SantaFe-WebDesign.com. This is a short tutorial and an easy one on how to do a powerful backlinking technique from Blogger. Blogger is a free blogging tool owned by Google now, and it's a wonderful tool to help you build content on your website or off your website. In this case, I'm recommending that the blog be hosted on your website, and your web designer will know how to do that for you. Um, this particular technique takes advantage of keywords that you've already researched as good keywords, and choosing them as a link to link back to other pages on your website. If you don't understand keyword research, I highly recommend that you listen to the first tutorial. You watch the first tutorial in this series, uh, Finding the Best Keywords, and that you buy the keyword tutorial available at santafe-webdesign.com. It's $15. It's got everything you need to prepare your web pages for your web designer in a way that your site will actually work for you in bringing people to you. Okay, so you can see that I've already got a blog going here, the Keyword Coach free video keyword uh, blog, and I've got a post going here. This is actually my second post, and this tutorial sort of takes for granted that you know how to do this much. Blogger has a fantastic help menu. It's incredibly easy. Uh, and also the keyword tutorial has a chapter which is very helpful for this, especially to help you get started in a way that uh, maximizes your web ranking potential as a result of the blog. You can see here that there's a sentence that starts with visit Santa Fe Web Design. Santa Fe Web Design is my best keyword so if I highlight that keyword and I link, click on this link icon and go up here and type the web address, if I spell it right, and hit OK, you'll see that that text turns blue and is underlined and it becomes a link. Uh, so I'm using my best keyword to link to a page that's optimized for that keyword. And the keyword tutorial will help you understand how to do that, as will the previous video on this blog. So th that we're also going to link to an individual post on this blog, which is the first post. So we're going to highlight the text, which is the name of that post, but we have to find the address of that post. And I'm going to show you how to do that. This is a little bit more advanced, but if you, if you just follow me, it's really pretty simple. So you see where it says View Blog? I'm going to hold my Apple Command key down. You can hold your Control key down and click on that link so it should open a new window for you. And I'm at my Keyword Coach free video keyword tutorials blog. And I'm going to scroll down to where it says Previous Posts. I'm going to go to the first one, which is my keyword tutorial number one, Find the Best Keywords. I'm going to right-click on it and choose Copy Link Location. Your browser might say Copy Shortcut, but find something that talks about copying the link uh, information. And if you don't have a right mouse button, you can use the Control key and click on the link. So I'm going to copy the link location. I'm going to close this window and go back to where we were in the post and highlight that phrase, find the best keywords. And that's a pretty good keyword phrase too. So it's great when you link, when you make a link that is a keyword phrase linking to a page that's about that. So that's exactly what we're going to do and I'm going to hi highlight the phrase and click the link button and now I'm going to delete this and just hit paste by hitting command V, Apple command V or control V on your computer if you're on a PC. So hit OK. You can see that's a really long URL. It's a long address. It's nice not to have to type that in and make a mistake, right? So click OK and here we are. We've got two links going. And 
you can read this little post that's going to be on there. You can, can you see how I linked the phrase Santa Fe Web Design to my site? I could have linked the URL santafe-webdesign.com, but that doesn't include my keyword exactly. So you want to be using an, a phrase that's a good keyword phrase. All right, we're going to publish this post. Click Publish Post. Wait for it to transfer. And it's published successfully. I'm going to open the new window, which it lets me do easily this way. And try that click again. And there it is. So you can see Tuesday, August 7th, keyword tutorial number two. And if you roll your cursor over Santa Fe Web Design, you'll see it's a link. And if you click on it, it goes to my website. Click go back. And here, if we click on Find the Best Keywords, it's going directly to that particular post on my blog. It's a very great technique to use. So now we're linking, so if I go back again, here's the actual post. We're linking to my website and we're linking to my blog from within the blog using keywords in both cases. That's the trick I wanted you to understand today is that you don't want to be linking URLs like this www.santafe-webdesign.com. You want to be linking actual phrases. Search engines pay attention to that because they match those phrases match what people are typing into Google. Uh, you'll use this te linking technique in other places as well other than blogs and if you want to for instance on your website and if you want to learn more about that you know pick up the keyword tutorial from santafe-webdesign.com and watch the previous video, find the best keywords, um, and visit me there on the site and email me hope at santafe-webdesign.com. I'd love to hear from you.